Well, it's 8 o'clock on a Sunday morning. I'm walking in the rain to the start of my first race for 2020. Don't you love racing in the summertime in New Zealand? Welcome to the first race of 2020. Um, so this is just a short 10k race. It's on Mount Victoria, which is basically just outside my back door. So uh, I'm walking into the start line. Uh, this is the trail we're going to be racing on at some point today. Uh, and it appears the rain didn't get the memo that it's supposed to be finished by now. Uh, it's been raining pretty much every night this week. Uh, just a nice soft gentle rain which is really what we need with all the drought conditions we've, we've got. So the rain is welcomed, I just wish it would stop now. Just just for a little bit. Next couple of hours would be fine. Uh, but not to worry. So uh, this is just a bit of a, a shakedown test. I've not done a 10k race before. Um, so I've done plenty of longer races but I haven't done a Tinko, so uh, this is going to be really interesting to see just how far back the pack I am. So one of the cool things about walking into the start, particularly walking on the track we're going to be running on, is we get to have a bit of a look at what the conditions like with all the rain. Uh, there's a few puddles here and there, but it's actually not too bad. Um, of course it'll be probably quite a bit muddier after all the runners have been through in front of me, but uh, at least so far I haven't encountered anything that's uh, like a huge puddle you get a wade through or anything, so that's a good start. Alright, so we're coming up on the velodrome now. This, this track actually goes along. Uh, the same part of course, the end of the, the week you can, so I'm reasonably familiar with this, but although well, uh, not usually running at first thing in the morning, usually running at last thing at night. Right, and here we are at the race start. It's, it's only me so far. There's a good chance I'll come in second. Okay, we're two k's in, and I've got a huge burst of speed and went past a whole bunch of people. Heart rate is pounding, but it's quite lovely. It's not raining so much here, and at this stage, I don't think I'm lost. 
Okay, a bit of a recovery. And then we're back up the hill to the road. And we'll be exposed to something. At least the rain stopped. Well, that's a 5k finish is done. We've got one more lap to do. So it was about 33 minutes for 5k. Which is not bad on the trail considering the hills we've got. So I'm pretty happy with that. I'm starting to die in the hills now. So that first 5k it was a max effort, went as hard as I could, because it's only a 10 k race. That's this part of it's just keep going. That's also a, it's a test of keeping my heart rate up, well over 160, and just see how well I can tolerate that. But the rain stopped. It's not overly cold. This is not a bad day for it, really. How much fun is this? It's like dancing, really. As you can probably surmise, things have got a bit warm. I can drop the jacket off. That cost me five places or six places. So now I'm just trying hard to catch up. So not far to go now. A couple of big hills left. But not far. I'm running well. Quite liking this. Big hill climb now, back up to the main trail, and it's mostly flat ish to the finish. So I won't be first, but I don't think I'll be last. And this is it, I have no idea how many people have turned up for the 10k race. So I might well be last. But this has been a bunch of fun. It's really nice to just throw it all down and know that I don't have another 50 odd k's to run. Uh, and so far, I've actually been running really well. First lap, monster the hill climbs. Uh, I'm running really well downhill. And this time I'm I'm dying on the hills to be fair. Uh, but I'm still running really well downhill. And downhill is one of my weaknesses. So, happy with the improvement in that. Still more work to do on my lungs. Uh, but, we're getting there. Finish line is just around the corner. I love these sprint races.
right, that's the first race of 2020. That went quite well. I was quite happy with how I ran that. So I died a bit on the hills towards the end, but I was pushing hard, you know, so that's kind of expected, really. But now when I could run, I was running hard, running fast. Uh, no problems with my footing, you know, tripping on all the roots and loose um, dirt and all that kind of stuff. So, no, really happy with that. Not sure what my placing is, but I wasn't last because I managed to watch some people come over the finish line after me. So, that's the main thing. But now we're off to a good start. Bring on the Wood UK. Oh, so now we're just taking a gentle jog home. And then go back to work. But it's not a bad way to spend a Sunday morning. Uh, that was actually a bunch of fun, I really enjoyed that.